It's currently morning for me, but good afternoon royals and welcome back to my channel. As you see by the title, today's video is basically a week of self-care. There's so much going on within this vlog. I took you guys along with me, stepped on the scale, and your girl has been gaining weight. I haven't been working out, obviously. Like, I haven't worked out since March, and it's, it's freaking October, so that's already terrible in itself. Started to eat meat, so um, that itself, like, made me gain weight, like, quickly. Like, that's when my skin started breaking out. I know you guys have noticed. My skin started to break out, and then I started to gain a bunch of weight, which... You know whatever so basically i'm just giving you like a quick rundown of like the reason why i felt like i needed this self-care as well as just like i have been like overworking myself been feeling very overwhelmed a human being can only take but so much you guys are going to see me like getting my hair done getting my nails done and stuff like that but like there also may be a few transparent moments in there as well i'll see you guys in the next clip hey guys good morning so right now it's currently about seven in the morning we're about to go grocery shopping i decided to weigh myself this morning which was like a terrible mistake and i learned that i weighed 10 additional mother pounds. <laughs> so, I guess really, really, really in the works now. So, I just thought I'd take you guys along with me. On my way to my hair appointment, not the bang yang. I got my closure pushed back. Um, I just stop at the bank and get cash so that I could pay the remainder of my appointment fee balance or whatever. No, I hate that it's dark outside because y'all can't even see me in all my glory. <laughs> in all my glory. I'm so excited, you guys. This is actually. A package from Dossier. Okay. Because <laughs> I thought it was like something from Shein, but it's not. So I so I unboxed it. They're so annoying. Let me spray this to see what it hits for. Oh, oh, it smells so good. Oh, I'm about to get chose. I'm about to get chose. Good morning, you guys. So it's the next morning. So I went to go hang out with my cousins yesterday because my cousins came into town. I think I vlogged a quick second, so I may go ahead and insert that right now. What's up? I want to have. Currently, I'm on my way um, to go get an e-check for my car so I can get new plates. I better be clear. After that, I'm about to try to just go straight to a nail salon because y'all, my nail broke dead in half. And I don't even want to push it back because it hurts so bad. I'm gonna show y'all though. Ah! So, I'm gonna go get my nails done because that is, no. And I might just go ahead and get a pedicure too, but I have to see who's open. It's crazy because the place that I like going to for a pedicure, I don't like them to do my nails, but I might just get everything done today. Okay, stop right there. Put it in park and turn it off. Okay. Can I get a pet? I'm gonna get a pedicure too. Treat yourself. Hi, do you guys have any available 10 a.m. appointments? I want to get a cut down and a fill in and a pedicure. We don't have 10 a.m. Maybe about 10 30. Okay, uh, your name is? Ali, A L I. Thank you. You can come live early about 10, 15, 10, 20, something like that. Okay. We don't know, we check you early. Okay. All right. All right, thank you. Bye. Mm -hmm. All right, so I just went ahead and got that settled. I'm gonna pass, I'm gonna place this up here on your dashboard. Perfect, board. thank you. Because of the COVID, we can't do the hand to hand. Okay. So you can take that to the BMV to get your um, sticker and have a nice day. All right, you too, thank you. Well. Baby, we passed, me and my baby passed. Can I please order um, the super fruit? Okay. I think that's gonna be all. Okay, you're telling us nine fifty seven. Okay, thank you. So yeah, you guys, I'm currently at Panera Bread. I 
decided let me go stop and get a smoothie since I had some time to kill. Hi. Okay. Thank you. Me too. All right, you guys. So we're about to try this smoothie and see if it's good or not. It's not bad, but it's not aerobic. But I guess that's good because that means it's probably healthier. It tastes like banana. It's like no matter what color the smoothie, what smoothie you get, baby, if it got banana in it, you got yourself a banana smoothie. I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors, pay for everything on my plate. Sometimes I'd even get the steak. Cause I got it like that. Always have my own bag, never needed no man to rely on. Got two good shoulders to cry on. I was alright on my own. Till I fell, but it wasn't fake. And I couldn't tell at the time, but I was my own soulmate. It's like I forgot I was fine, let you treat me any kind of way And now I'm free, you gotta celebrate You couldn't see everything and stay That that I wasn't afraid to say, yeah If I gotta choose me, I won't be afraid to If I gotta choose me, I gotta do what I gotta do When I love you, I lose me Now I can't be attached to you no more I like me better when I wasn't yours I'm going back hey you guys so i did actually film another clip okay so let me just explain right now i'm currently about to leave and go and get my hair touched up um my closure maintenance i actually went and got this done a couple days ago but it was not done properly and the next day my closure was literally up today has been such a, such a, such a rough day not even being funny this day has been kicking my ass I'm just like trying to get my life together and just get things back on track but it's like also during this process of me trying to get my life back on track like things kind of went a little south and like i'm going through a lot right now like a lot so like because if y'all see that my eyes are puffy and my face is red that's why like when i'm in a bad mood i give myself like 24 hours to like just like be in my pain and just like cry it out sing it out dance whatever the case and then it's like okay sweetie it's time to pick it up i did get my car detailed i wish i would have like film that for you guys got my car fixed i got a detail I'm gonna, I'm gonna go take my new id picture and get like my new plates i'm also gonna like um i need new tires and stuff so after that i'll be all done with car maintenance which i'm excited about so much that comes with having a car but we're blessed let's put on some music and vibe out all righty so i just made it to my hair appointment about to go ahead and get messed up and then go knock on the door i gotta tell y'all something when we get back in the car okay you guys i'm back i got my hair straightened at least somewhat don't really like it because i personally feel like if it's not bone straight it don't look good you know what i mean like and it's not bone straight today is just a shitty ass day and i'm just gonna be honest when i say that a couple days ago when i got my hair done literally the next day i said can you fit me in sometime this week because my my closure has already lifted when i was on my way home from chicago i texted her i said hey you do maintenance right and she said yeah i said what does that include she said it includes removal of the closure tightening of the trash and then like relaying the closure and i'm like all right cool so then i had booked it y'all when i got there she was like oh your closure still looks so good mind you you could tell she about to go somewhere she like oh your closure looks so good you want me to take it off and put it back on i'm just like if you don't take it off um i'll take ten dollars off of it i'm like okay whatever because i'm thinking like yeah she's not gonna take it off but she's still about to like at least clean it off and do what she's supposed to do so she goes to lay it by the time i leave it was something on my closure i'll insert the clip and my closure relay but i think it's something on my closure i'm gonna have to clean it off i'm like why does my closure look like it got a little chunk on it and i even feel like that right now like why what is that like i don't want that and she was like oh yeah like you can come on monday so y'all i get over her house i knocked on the door no answer a couple minutes later i knocked on the door and i heard her the kids like mommy mommy like um somebody's at the door 
So I give it a few minutes. I'm like, maybe she's just trying to straighten up a little bit before I come inside. After a while, I'm like, all right. So I text her. I'm like, I'm here. Y'all know how y'all around somebody and you know how they operate when it comes to their phone. She literally will stop in the middle of straightening and straining my hair to text somebody back if they text her. So I know you're always on your phone. She ain't text me back. So a few minutes went by. I said, okay, let me go sit back in my car because I'm about to get irritated. I'm like, why is this day so horrible? Like, I'm just trying to, I'm like, okay, this was the one thing I was looking forward to. Like, I'm about to get my hair slayed. Yeah, I called her. She answered in the middle of the first ring. Like, hello. I'm like, I'm outside. She like, okay. But the thing that bothered me, I know you saw my text and your kids told you I was at the door. You was trying to play like you was dead. That's corny. They're going to be like, hey, girl, how was your day? No, you don't give a about how my day was my day was up i was excited to come here and get my hair done and then you just try to play me to the side i don't like that you don't treat people like that all this that's not making me happy you gotta go you gotta go because you're taking away from my productivity and just the shit. but it's okay because like i said I'm giving myself today to stress out about it y'all see my <laughs> this street was so bumpy i'm giving myself today to stress out about it and we're on to the Okay, period. The sun is a bit weird and my face looks puffy from yesterday, but we moved. I just came from UPS. I returned every single thing. Well, not everything. There's still like three more things that I need to return, which is like fine because I had like 20 total. Like I had so much stuff that I need to return. So I did all of that. And now I'm about to go ahead and I'm at the gas station. I'm about to pump some gas. Today is currently Wednesday. I'm about to go ahead and put this on. Um, this one is actually a pre-printed one because right now I have my, the one that's printed, I have it um, in my laundry bin to wash, which I'm about to go wash after I finish this segment of my day. But I do sell these on my site and it's printed and it says Crown Beauty on it. I have a 1.30 eyebrow appointment. Um, before my eyebrow appointment, I am gonna go over to my mom's house and basically just help her close some clothes. So today I'm gonna go through my clothes and stuff that I can no longer fit. I just bought a bunch of new clothes. So I might give some away to my family. Other stuff I may put like on a Poshmark or a Depop or something. If you guys are interested, you guys can go ahead and check it out. Basically that's what's going on right now. And I'm about to go ahead and get into some like self-care here so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna be working with some nose pore strips also got these iPads you can use them hot or cold of course I decided cold so they have been in the freezer We give it 10 to 15 minutes and let it dry and in that time i'm about to go ahead and read and now i'm currently on my way to my eyebrow appointment it's 1 14 and my appointment is at 1 30 i'm supposed to arrive at 1 22 so i'm gonna be early and then after my eyebrow appointment i have to go stop and pick up my bonnets i want to actually like take the time to decorate my room i have like five more months left on my lease hashtag i've been treating myself a lot like a lot a lot so i'm just excited and i think it's necessary i do want to do my second part of grocery shopping so that i can really like start this vegan thing and just so you guys know this is my eyebrows before i'm about to get them threaded and then um tinted as well so i am on my way to a seafood restaurant you guys may or may not know i don't really eat seafood like that just because my dad is allergic to shellfish girl took her sewing out i'm currently out i'm about to run some errands i told you guys some days ago i was to do some shopping for like decor and whatnot so that's what i'm um doing right now i'm currently pulling up to tj maxx all 
all right so i'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff i got from big lodges because i feel like everything else is like pretty boring and homey i got this deep repair mask for my hair because i've tried it before it smells amazing it worked really well and you guys know i just took out my hair so i'm like yeah let me do that then i got this uh curl enhanced smoothie um i got some tweezers at this picture this says i figure if a girl wants to be a legend she should go ahead and be one which i really liked i got myself journals because like i told you i have an issue a problem a true true issue i have one that says make it happen so there's going to be an additional idea jot down type of journal and i got this which i loved how detailed it was i got these i got these two containers um my intention was for me to like put things like like all my my planners and journals and stuff like that and keep them like next to my bed well i really would like prefer them under my bed but i realized like, there's no such thing as like under my bed so i don't know what i'll end up doing with these but we'll see i'm sure i can like keep them in my closet with some stuff but yeah so i got those so i got those two things i got myself a new yoga mat because i actually just threw out my yoga mat the other day so i got that i got this container here just because i've been trying to get like my accessories and i lose accessories so often so i was like let me just get this so that i can like keep up with it speaking of accessories i also got these because now that my hair is down i really really need to make sure i have earrings in got some new kitchen essentials and then i got 60 hangers because so that all my hangers can be like the same color and we can be on one page you know classy ish then i got this so if you can't tell basically i'm trying to go for like a pink and like pink gray and like green type of thing so basically right now in my room the first area that i want to work on is right here because basically i kind of want to turn it into an area where i just basically wake up in the morning i can get out the bed come over here and just like journal i want to get into meditation i have to like really work on like trying to clear my mind but i want to be able to get into like meditation yoga and all that stuff so basically that's where i want this area to be able to become for me i already went out and got the, well i ordered it off of amazon a really really long time ago um but it's a stool i can sit on when i'm like writing and stuff like that and then i have these right here my goal today is to find a way to like place these aesthetically around here so that it of course looks good and then also just puts me like in a good mind space to do all the things that I just named. After that I'm going to go through and do like my clothes. I don't know if I'm going to do that part on camera just because it's going to take a really like long time and I don't want to overwhelm you guys with content. It's Areas looking like right now. I'm gonna move on to another part of my room right now. Okay guys, so this is how it looks. I decided to keep the stool on this side now that the Be Your Own Kind of Beautiful is over there. Um, and then that's this side. But I am thinking about getting another stool or something to go right there because I really like the stool. So I might just get another stool, honestly. And then I move this over here. Now, oh, I'm out of breath. Sorry, I'm, I've been doing stuff all day. And I also been having this like rug for forever and I finally just put it right there. I don't know if it's going to stay. But I put that right there. Um... And that bag is like full of jewelry that I need to put into that clear container. Those are the things that I like. Those are like the sticky I use to put all of my pictures up. I'm going to put some pictures up around the room. And that stuff right there are the clothes that I don't want to keep. And I'm going to give away and or sell. 
as far as the closet this side of things have been um put onto the new hangers but this side i'm gonna have to do later and then i did like kind of I did kind of organize like my shoe area as well. I need to go through this bag of shoes and some of those are going to get thrown out. Not done with my room transformation like whatsoever. This was just me like getting started in like my first day. I also would like to see part two of my room transformation and like another lifestyle vlog. Make sure you let me know that down in the comment section below. But I figure I'll go ahead and just end this vlog right here because I don't want it to go on too long. I really, really enjoyed it just this vlog and everything that included just me like trying to get my life together physically and mentally even though your girl looks a little fry right now but that's okay i'm still god's child so i'm beautiful the emoji of the day is going to be how about your favorite emoji at the moment whatever the case may be comment that down below also remember to comment down below any um questions comments, concerns video suggestions compliments all that good stuff and i will see you guys in my next video thank you guys so much for staying tuned peace